Um, hey guys, so, um, before the video starts, just wanted to say, um, Hajime, well, Yandere, Hajime, won the poll. So here he is, so here he is. <laughs> Hope you guys are ready for it, but like, uh, I just wanted to say that, like, thank you to Macy slash Dawn for helping me with the thumbnail and all that, so like, I'll be crediting crediting her in the description below. I was the one who like like suggested like um this like the Hajime like picture and all that there because like I thought it was perfect for the idea. And um but I just wanted to um but trigger warning for those like because this video is gonna contain like yarn excuse me, yandere behavior, um, psychoness, um, uh, killing, and, oh, uh, yeah, I'll be, and also 13 plus, I'll be putting, like, the trigger warnings in the description below, and, um, hope you guys, like, having a good day or night, and enjoy the video. Love you guys. <laughs> you were walking in the middle of the night. It was, uh, you were. T it was a quiet night, but you thought it was a bit too quiet, and you had a feeling that something was wrong. But you thought you were just being paranoid and decided to brush it off. <sighs> so. You continue walking, then all of a sudden, you hear a scream for help. So you start running towards the scream, but but then you start hiding behind, like, behind the wall of the alleyway. Because you didn't want to be, like, a scene, because you knew that, like, whoever is doing this could be dangerous. You look behind, like, you take a peek of what's happening to the person who screamed for help. There he was. Uh, a boy with brown hair and yellow eyes. Uh, P.S. I, I, I don't know why, but, like, I think Hajime's eyes are yellow or, like, I don't know, like, if I butcher that, I deeply apologize. Anyway, back to the roleplay. With the white shirt that splattered with pink blood on his, on the palm of his hand and all over his hand. With the green tie and yellow writing. <laughs> oh, well, look at that. Looks like he died. Ah, well, that is quite upsetting. Hmm. Might as well get rid of the body then. <laughs> you had shivers. Start. You had a shiver ran down your spine, and goosebumps started appearing on, on your skin from the fear when, like, from what this man has done. He can, who couldn't be around, he can be more than 17 years old. Which, like, around your age. <clears throat> you, uh, you decided to, like, um, start calling the police when all of a sudden, when all of a um, sudden he noticed you that you saw what he has done. Ah, you weren't supposed to see this. Ah, ah, such, such a shame. He grabbed you and pinned you to the wall. You were now trapped with him in the alleyway where nobody else was around. Ah, ah, you really weren't supposed to see what I've done here. Ah. 
such a stupid person you are. How naive can you get? Seriously. Hmm. Now, tell me, how much did you see? You, you replied in a shaking voice, pretty scared of what he was going to do to you next. So you just, um, you, you just replied, you replied in a shaking voice saying that, like, you, like, you saw everything he did. Just be, he, you wanted to be honest considering you don't know, you already know what this guy, what, what this guy is capable of. <sighs> Well, I see. Huh. You know, I would kill you, but something's telling me not to. Hmm. Wait. I recognize you. Though, I don't think we've spoken before. We go to the same school. I know you are a listener. You were shocked to know that this guy knew who you were, but you didn't know him considering you guys have never crossed paths before. Uh, I am Ajime Hinata. The name kind of ring bells to you, as you know that as you know that there was a reserve course as well, and you you have heard of the name before. You just never met fate. You never met face to face and cross paths. Ah, I see from your face expression you you have heard of my name, but we've never met before. But if I'm being honest. How do I know you? Well, if I'm being honest, I've been watching you for a while now. You were shocked to know that Hajime was watching was watching you. You start your legs started um trembling and shaking from fear, and your voice began shaking even more than before. Well, What's wrong, listener? Scared? <laughs> you shouldn't be scared. Don't worry. I know I'm currently covered in blood, but... Be fine, but... Now that you see... Now that you see what I've done... I won't let you leave. You have no choice but to stay with me. Forever, listener. <laughs> You were scared and decided to get away. You kicked him in his crotch and started ru and started running. But little did you know that he had a backup plan in case something like this happened. You felt you felt your like you felt like him coming up behind you and then start then had something against your mouth. It was chloroform. You immediately realized what was going to happen. You tried struggling out of his grasp, but to no avail. You just kept getting weaker and weaker until you passed out. <sighs> oh, listener. Finally. Now, you're all mine now. Don't worry. I'll keep you safe and sound. Just so you know, nobody is coming for you. You're all mine now, listener. 